everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about what I got from Zara, H&M and Banana Republic for this season. Now let me tell you right away that all these things are just the basics, nothing over the top fancy expensive items. And like I always say before starting any video like this is please don't go into the description box and click all the links and purchase every item that is out there. Uh, just carefully analyze your own wardrobe and see what is needed and what's not needed because your personal style might be very different from my personal style and uh, it's totally fine if you don't relate to these items i feel like these were the items that were missing from my wardrobe or i already had uh, some of these items but they were very old and i needed to replace them and that was the part of reason why i bought these items now keep in mind that i uh, thought about purchasing these items for like three months now and uh, after carefully looking at my own closet uh, I have come to a conclusion of spending my money on these particular pieces so just be very careful about where you spend your money uh, and yeah without any further ado let's get started now let's start with one of my favorite brands Zara you know the weather is changing here in Canada it's getting so cold and layering becomes very important so what I used to do earlier was to layer uh, all my jackets my blazers my coats uh, with something like this so these are the spaghetti tops or uh, camisole tops whatever you may want to call them uh, but their straps are very thin and I've realized that I needed something long uh, to tuck into my jeans or my pants and I needed some wide straps and I wasn't able to find anything good at least of good quality from H&M so when I started looking around I found that Zara has perfect collection with all the neutral colors of these white strap uh, basic pieces so this is the first item that i got and i bought them in two colors uh, black and white because i feel like these are basic neutral colors that will go with anything and everything now the material is very stretchy and very very soft uh, i just love these pieces and the sizing is perfect i got them in size small and they were 17.90 each if i'm not wrong but i will leave all the links in the description box down below and i feel like these pieces are perfect for layering and I will be using them a lot and uh, now that I have tried and tested them I think I will be buying uh, the other two colors as well because they are again very neutral beige and pink so yeah it will be perfect for this winter season there is no way that i uh, go online for shopping and i don't buy a linen button down shirt so that's what i did next on zara's website and this is what i got uh, this was a little bit on the expensive side because this fabric is expensive uh, in general so i got it for 49.90 in size small now uh, one thing that i didn't like about this shirt is the sleeves i usually like my fit oversized but i feel like the shirt is oversized but uh, the sleeves are very tight on me i don't know something doesn't fit right and i have already placed a return on this one but i really like the color you know beige is my favorite and it's such a nice and neutral and calming color i will keep searching for a good beige shirt but this one was just not for me i will show you guys maybe on the side uh, what it looked like and what is not working maybe i can roll up the sleeves but for 50 dollars, i don't think i want to compromise but overall this shirt was very good i would say if i were to give my honest review i would say just go for something oversized for the sleeves but if you don't mind something like this just go for it the quality is very good unfortunately i am returning this piece now for the next item it is very colorful i know it might come as a surprise to you guys but for the longest time i wanted to add a very pretty mint olive color in my color palette and i really wanted to try that color for some reason so i found this blazer on zara's website and i think this color is perfect and it goes really really well with my skin tone my complexion everything my hair color my eye color everything so this one i got it for 19 not 19 dollars definitely not 19 dollars i take that back i wish it was 19 dollars but it's 99 dollars and 90 cents so 100 dollars 
So this one is in size small and I really love the fit and color of this. The sizing is perfect. This will go a long way in my closet and that's why I bought this. So now let's move on to our next brand which is H&M. Uh, again, I bought four items from H&M. The first one, again, brace yourself are skinny jeans so i bought two skinny jeans one in blue one in black i know i know let's have a petition to bring back skinny jeans please i don't know why i donated my old jeans they were just perfect i think i just listened to the fashion gurus or the trends that are going on i shouldn't have i should have known better but skinny jeans are perfect for winter season especially when i'm at work if you don't know me enough i work on a construction site it's pretty much every day that i go on a construction site and i think these are the most comfortable pair of jeans that you can have for a job like this so i bought two of them let me just show you on the side what it looks like if you guys don't know you should download the h&m app make an account there sign up for their membership it's free and this is not sponsored this is not an ad but just a pro tip from my side to you uh, that please sign up for their membership because uh, then you can save a few dollars on every item that you put in your cart because you are already a member so all they need is your phone number or your email id i guess and my size for h&m jeans is usually uh, between four and six and for these skinny jeans uh, i bought us six and it was perfect it fit like a glove the next basic item that i was really excited about was this blazer so i bought the size medium i made the wrong decision i should have bought a size small but it was out of stock so yeah i just had a fear of missing out just say whatever you want to say but i am going to return this blazer and i don't think i will purchase one in small size because I don't like the material. I don't know. It's it's too thin and uh, I don't like how it sits on my body. Even if it was a size small, I will not like that piece. So yeah, this is the next item. But anyway, I'll show you guys on the side what it looks like uh, just in case you guys are interested to buy something like this. So this blazer, I got it for $43. Like I said earlier, uh, I am actively trying to include mint olive color in my closet. And that's the reason why I purchased this skirt from H&M. It's a very nice, very neutral and minimalistic print. It's a pleated skirt uh, in olive color. This was again a disappointment. I know um, it usually doesn't happen uh, on my H&M orders, but for some reason I picked uh, the pieces. <laughs> I think I picked up the wrong pieces. So the stitching where the elastic is, it goes like this. It's not straight. It goes down some places and it's up at some places. So the quality of this skirt is not worth the price that you are paying. Uh, and this one, I guess, was for $28 or $35. Check the link in the description box if you are interested. Now, I don't know if it was just this piece that was defected or not. But uh, I'll think about if I want to buy... Uh, another piece or maybe just go to the store and try some of these pieces look at some of these pieces if the whole lot is defected then yeah i don't want it but if it's only this one which i hope it's only this one uh, then i'll uh, think about buying uh, the other piece but yeah this is the next piece that i bought which unfortunately now i have to return so the h&m purchase was all worth it because of this one next piece which is this cream sweater vest uh, now it might look like as if it's white but it's not it's cream in color and the quality is really good although it's uh, somewhat thin but i really like this piece it's so chic and uh, it will give a very classy vibe once i pair this up with my white button down shirt and i got this idea from pinterest to be very honest and i feel like that yes this is my style and i'm so happy that i got this vest and i have purchased this in size small so it is a bit oversized and i think uh, for any look like this you do want uh, an oversized item so yes uh, purchase your usual size uh, my usual is 
S and it fits perfectly. Earlier I had my doubts uh, because it was too long and I thought it will make me look short if I don't tuck it inside but it's all good. Uh, when I tried this I was super happy because I was really sad uh, the day that this order arrived and I tried the skirt first and I was like oh my god and then I tried the blazer next and I was like okay this whole order is gonna make me feel very sad because you know when your online order arrives how happy you are to try all these pieces and just hope that everything fits perfectly and if it doesn't then it actually makes me cry i don't know why but yeah this piece is one of my favorite and i'm going to wear this the whole season a lot now let's move on to our next brand which is banana republic actually it's banana republic factory the reason why i have kept this brand after zara and h&m is because all these items are out of stock and i really apologize for that but i bought these items on clearance back in july or august from states us i was just uh, confused whether i should show you guys these items or not but then i thought I should better show these items because this forms a part of like the whole haul video and all the basics that I've got this season. So the first item that I got is this very lightweight uh, open front cardigan. It has some buttons uh, in the front and it's a pretty pastel yellow color uh, which I think will go perfectly well in my closet. I already have white black and gray cardigans like these uh, so one thing i was missing was color so i thought yes uh, this will be a perfect addition and the size is small now before i show you guys my next piece i just wanted to share with you guys something uh, you know there are some times when you think about you're not good enough or something that you're wearing is not good enough and people will not like it that's usually not the case and trust me i'm coming from a vast experience because this particular reel I thought was not good enough. I thought that the quality is not good and people will ridicule it or you know it was I was going for perfection uh, which apparently you can never never achieve so don't go for perfection just do whatever you want to do and post that reel post that first video uh, just make that first step happen and everything will eventually fall into place uh, now the reason why i'm talking about this is because the next piece is this cream sweater with blue stripes now uh, this reel actually went viral and you guys liked it so much it got million plus views i never expected that i was really shocked when i saw the insights of that reel that you guys liked it so much uh, everyone has saved that reel and yeah everyone just kept asking where you got this sweater from uh, and the quality of the video is very nice which camera do you use to shoot your videos and just right before posting that video i was thinking that the quality is not good enough i was actually thinking of removing that draft from my instagram but i was so wrong and from that day i decided not to judge myself too much and not let uh, my perception of perfection get into the way of me posting the content i will just keep posting whether i'm happy with the final product or not and let destiny do its own thing uh, if it's meant to be it will be so yeah that's the only thing that i wanted to say and i'm sorry about the lighting it gets changed all the time in canada so let's just move on let's jump on to our next item which is this brown chocolatey brown sweater that you have already seen in one of my previous youtube video and also on instagram but to be honest i don't like its quality i think it's very thin and i don't know how long it will last it has already started uh stretching uh but partially because i hanged it um for like three weeks in my closet i think that's the reason why the threads are all stretched but um again uh, like looking at the basics i don't like the quality but i love love the color and even if uh, this doesn't last me too long even if it's like two years i'm happy with that because i think it was just for 20 dollars not more than that so yeah this is the next piece so we have finally reached to a point in this video where i'm showing you guys 
the last piece uh, this is a very chunky oversized turtleneck sweater from banana republic again in size small so this pretty much wraps up our haul video these are all the pieces that i wanted to show you guys and just as a reminder if you're still watching this video you don't have to buy all these pieces don't try to find uh, alternatives or something like that uh, just keep in mind that this is uh, something that i relate to uh, it's my personal style and if you feel like that this is something that will look good on your body type then yes go ahead and purchase it with that thought i will end this video and if you like it just like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next one bye